multiple characters, all of whom are attacking all around you. So I think his awareness is going to be tested here, and he's going to need to be on point if he wants to take out this upset. Oh man, well, we're starting on FD. Interesting choice. Uh, I think I, I honestly wouldn't think that a uh, blue team would want to go through with this, but Big up smash. I think they're they're able to handle. Yeah, blue themselves. team already seems like they have oh. complete control of center. Yeah, that, that, was <laughs> no. like, that was a quick one. All right, uh -oh. <laughs> free kind of grabbing into the corner. I feel like Marth, he's kind of naturally a support character. Um, you're just gonna want to see him combo into some quick down airs. Always be poking, staying safe. Oh, oh good charge forward smash there. Uh, yeah, and this is re really side. where you want to like build up damage. Is when one space is down, you can go to town. Oh, you can get a convert against Ginger. Oh, if they can get some big damage on the stock. Oh, <laughs> he almost forward smashed Skurza there. And um, this is let's see, here's a big back throw. Oh, oh that's a gift. Skurzo. Oh, uh -oh. Well, that was a great counter, counter shine though. Oh, oh he's not done. He didn't touch. Man, that was, that was almost such a nice conversion, and then yeah. it actually just got turned on a dime. Yeah, that's all about it in doubles. Like, you can have your eyes on the prize, on that big gimp, but if you're, especially if you're a spacey, you can't just, like, pull in and pull up B and recover. Oh. Oh. The yeah. catapult. Yeah. And I think that's kind of, like, one of Fox's big strengths, is that his ability to just, like, at, like, a spot almost, just instantly be able to put out a hitbox, which can finish off the opponent. That's, like, why he's so good, even better than he is in singles. And here's the chain grab, yeah. And um, here's... I kind of like that back air. You know, even though he hits the, his opponent, that's, like, much better than getting team coming. But there's... Um, Interesting scrap. Oh, Everybody's okay. straighting off. Oh, oh nice double jab. Didn't he touch. Might be dead, but... Oh, but Fox is so good. And um, uh, there's up air first hit shine. And, um, Double up. If they could, oh, oh they could I don't like that forward out. smash. I if, feel like that Skurzo's guy there. Right, oh, if they can close it out. This might be not that bad. Oh, can you get the? Oh. oh. Okay. Okay. Um, still not a great spot, but. Yeah, you know they just yeah, brought it all the way back. Now this that was oh, like. Oh, okay. That's that's not great. All right. Yeah. Let's Mark see how two much, v one very hard. Uh oh. Let's see how much cheese uh, Kenny's has. Uh, that you no, know, there's no way. All right, that's game one, but you know. It's pretty clear that that just one moment right there where they brought it back to being almost even, that's like the kind of plays that like makes you confident in your game. Like, okay, if we just play it right, we play safe, we can get that big burst, and we can take those two stocks. And that feels a lot better than getting four or five stocks. Yeah, definitely uh, not getting blown out. It's definitely a good sign. And also, you know, these, these players are pretty high caliber. You know, there's double top 100. Both made a lot of waves in the recent yeah. years. Uh, oh, up throw, up tilt doesn't work out on that platform. And uh, Unis hits a lot of damage for that. Oh, man. Here's oh. Ginger with a very good call out when he was able to back air Skurzo. What it looked like he was going to try and run out and edge guard uh, Yunis. Whoa. Hmm. I don't know about the counter. I, I, like, countering lasers in the middle of the stage, that just sounds kind of like you're just setting yeah. yourself up. And since the counter animation is so long, it doesn't even matter sometimes if it lands. And uh, the, uh, the opponent's teammate can just hit it oh. for free. Good forward smash. I can't believe but, uh, he outspaced that. <laughs> but he, oh, <laughs> another one. And um, oh, double oh, hit, but awkward trade. hits his teammate. I don't think Fat Goku fully recognized that. He might have been able to get it. <laughs> and... Um, you know. Yeah, honestly, it just kind of seems like Skurzo yeah. and Yunis are just kind of flinging around, not really playing with regard to each other. They're not really playing a team's game right now. Small moments of it, yeah. but... You know, I don't know how much Fat Goku and Ginger team. They might a lot. I mean, I feel like I know they're friends. That might be... Oh, no, it might be KG. I might be just making things up here, but... Uh, I can understand the desire to, like, have 1v1s if it's a really coordinated team. But generally, the philosophy goes, like, the bigger it's an upset in terms of single skill, the more you just want but fewer singles moments. But, you know. All right, we, we finally have some actual team. For, for a moment there, that was just, like, an entirely staggered match. Like, I think one of Red was always down or off the stage That's at all points. I feel like I was watching Here's Overwatch. Here's Nair to forward smash. Ooh, oh, I like that. Oh, oh, wow. I can't believe he snatched the ledge from that. All right, not terribly. The red team really oh. needs to start closing out these on the stocks. side B. Let Skurzo kind of back in the game, but oh, it looks like Sam's Park, Sam Park stocks are they're just going a little too fast. Yeah, this <laughs> just run up, jab up, smash. And oh, I thought Fox was gonna live for a second, but all right, Dad. Uh, Adrian's sick, but I, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know about this one. Yet. Uh oh, one oh, shine. Just go for him. Just get, just get him. Just get him. Oh. Get them. <laughs> 
All right. All right. Oh my God. Scurzo, Scurzo has a oh. deadpan focus. He's like, oh, yeah, I outplayed him. That's fourteen percent. Oh. oh. Oh man, if he didn't get that slide off, that'd be hilarious. <laughs> oh, get him. <laughs> I mean, anything can happen. They're just gonna play it safe. Full yeah. Midwest bias right now. Look, get look him. Ginger. Ginger is not even lazy. Yeah, he's just like, yeah, you handle it. Oh, oh, I respect okay. the fade back attempt. You like you can't really afford to recover on stage. You can just get attack, but so down 2-0. Scurzo has never I've never seen him take a set more seriously in his life. Look, if, <laughs> Ginger and Fako, they're just joking around. But I think the counter picks Dreamland. I understand like how you want more space. Maybe even Pokemon might be good choice for that. Um, but it se did seem like Fat Goku especially was able to live for longer periods of time. So Yeah, I think uh, Pokemon could be a decent choice here, but it's also going to kind of a, a gamble depending on what transformations they get. Uh, it seems like they're trying to go to Rainbow Cruise. If we're not in 2006. That's not legal anymore. Yeah. <laughs> Congo, no, go, oh, um, yeah, Congo Jungle, that's the legal one. Or the it, it was. Legal, it was yeah, uh, yeah. on the Evo rule set way back in the day. That was legal for, as a counter pick for doubles. Yeah. Because, you know, no Fountain of Dreams, so we need a counterpick stage, so they just added Congo. That that stage and uh, Rainbow Cruise were both legal when I started playing, and I've never disliked some stages as much as those. Oh, this is a great start. Yeah. You know, you have both of them off stage, and it's very hard, especially coming from Mark, because oh, he's going to be... Oh, oh one okay. stock? Up tilt fair. Oh, yeah. Yeah. I like that forward smash attempt, yeah. actually, because you cover, like... Because in doubles, it's, like, very... Um, it feels very natural for people to just hold in, try to tech with as little lag as possible, and just get back on the fight to help your teammate. Oh, oh that was a bit of an awkward swing. All right? Can oh, I like that Nair from Skurzo. He was able to uh, hit away Ginger. He should be okay here. Full hop. Oh, uh, no, yeah. Skurzo messed up his ledge stall. Yeah, that did not work how they planned. You can, uh, save. You can save him. Oh, we jab. I, I guess they traded back. You know, they're not actually. Red Team I still has it like a When did Ginger lose his first stock? I did not realize. It, it was right at the beginning of them. They knocked them both off stage. I think Fat Goku slipped through, oh, but yeah, Scourge yeah, was yeah, able yeah. to get a shine. Huh. So they're actually like kind of up They're right doing okay lead. for now, but. Light lead. This back throw would be kind of scary if it were not oh. Falco. Okay, at least Kenny's uh, was able to get past. Oh, no. That's. Yeah, he's shaking his head. He knows that he's just kind of hoping that they'll mess up and just kind of getting his laser drifts in. Oh, that's, oh, that's death. a forward that's double death. That's DI out. Wow, okay, this is this is a sizable lead. Even oh, though this, even this though transformation the feels really scary if you're Marth. Yeah, but they could also like, this is the potential that you're either gonna get like whacked up as Marth or you can get a lot of extra percent down against throw? the wall. Oh, <laughs> look at him. You really wanted that down tilt, but. Yeah, Ginger's been hit by yeah. that. Uh, it's like such really a high scary. value play in doubles. If you just make your recovery oh. longer, it's harder to keep that edge guard going without the risk of your teammate coming and Oh, like... messed up. There was an overextension. Oh, he <laughs> counters. Oh, no. <laughs> F smash? No. Okay, well, they, he, the laser. Scurzo lived at least. That'd yeah, been a huge turnaround. I don't even know what to think about that. What a trade. Oh, he misses up smash to cancel that. That's pretty big. And now he's going to get juggled. Oh, up air. Oh, oh he missed that would have been a finisher. Oh, he calls him down. Yeah, I think he could have maybe gone to ledge, but, you know, very scary. Man, that, <laughs> that went real good to not too great real fast. There's an up tilt. All right. There's a forward smash. Oh, oh what a power, power shield. shield but. Okay, nice. Nice setup. Uh -oh. If they can close this out, this is... Oh, okay, okay. He got the... I mean, at least got oh, the... he messes All right. up. All right. Uh, if they can... One need to get damage. Oh, no. Oh, this uh, is really bad. He needed to help him. Oh, they traded. Oh, no, that's... Oh, that should be it. No, no, no. Uh, <laughs> a little bit of a look of disbelief. I mean, you know, there were some pretty close interactions that set. Like, they've had some very good moments, but I felt like Fat Goku and Ginger's offense was so strong throughout the set, it was more than enough to kind of counteract that, and they won the set 3-0. Man, I, can't, I actually... Ginger having full faith in Fat Goku... Yeah. Just like, yeah, I'm just gonna trade this. I didn't think his. I think he was actually like below in percent, so it was like kind of technically a bad trade. But he's like, nah, you yeah. got this. I think it was also just because of the way the angle that Scurzo was recovering at. It was gonna be very hard to like get yeah. an edge guard, and it might be an extended edge guard. When then, if he's not paying attention, Marth can just run over Tipper, kill him at yeah, zero. Just swing him. Yeah. Eh. And also the, the percent differential on Marth to literally the fresh stock of Fat Goku is, yeah, it'd be hard. So that was one half of the losers or the winners uh, semis. So yeah. we, I hear Abu and Kells versus. Okay, we got a we got a Midwest matchup. We got yeah. the we have a.